what is going on everyone this is Wicked and today I will make an overview of another Note 8 port for Samsung Galaxy S8 and SE Plus running Android 7.1.1. I'm talking about the Ambassador Note 8 port. Now Ambassador ROMs were always well known for being stripped to the minimum, debloated and really stable and this ROM is no exception. Coming in a two package state, a main package and an add-on part, this will allow the flashing user to customize the apps and tweaks he wants to have on his phone. This ROM is kind of special because it is Odex. That means it is going to be slightly faster and more battery friendly in time over a Deodex ROM at the cost of no customization options. The Note 8 firmware is already known to be really fast compared to the stock one from the S8 and this Ambassador ROM with its debloating capabilities promises to be even more fluid. I'll leave a link in the description with their Telegram chat support and the XDA thread where you can find the ROM. Without further ado, let's get into the installation tutorial. As always, you'll need TWRP in order to install this ROM. If you don't know what TWRP is or how to install it, check the video in the card section. Then, I do always recommend making a backup of your current software so that if something goes wrong, you can restore it later without any data loss. Since this is a new Android version, I fully recommend you to wipe your device before flashing the ROM. Then, go to install and select the ROM zip and swipe to install. In Aroma Installer, you can select the root method and then your desired CSC. That's it for the main ROM base. Then you can opt to install the add-on package and select which extra apps you want to be installed and also the ability to select a sound module. And that's pretty much it. You can reboot your device afterwards and bear in mind the first booting process will take up to 5 minutes. Ok, so my device booted up. As you can already see the always on display from the Note 8 works perfectly. The lock screen also shows the Note 8 motion wallpaper, you can find all of them in the theme store and if you unlock the phone for the first time, this is what you'll see. This is what Ambassador ROM is all about, minimalism and incredible debloating options. Swipe up and you'll see all your installed apps. Let's notice how smooth the UI is, because since this ROM is running official Android 7.1.1, it benefits of a more responsive touch interface, the touch delay was minimized a lot and the difference as far as I'm concerned is really noticeable. Since this is a full Note 8 firmware, you'll also get the air command which unfortunately has so many features and apps which will only work with the S Pen. One which works by default and which I reviewed in detail is Live Message. I'll show a link at the end of my video. As you can clearly see, it is working great. Other features like Magnify, as you can notice, won't work without uh, the hovering features of the S Pen, so they are pretty useless. Many features implemented in the Note 8 software, like the App Pair, work great out of the box. The music app looks stunning showing the edge lining when playing a song and since we're here let's talk about the new edge lining, a feature which I also reviewed a couple of weeks ago. You'll get more advanced options compared to the stock S8 one, more colors to choose from and adjustable width and transparency. The Note 8 camera is also integrated in this ROM with its full view and uh, unfortunately there is a major bug in it and that's regarding the video stabilization option, video recording will fail if it is activated. Apart from that, I couldn't notice any major bugs. I suggest you to flash the ROM and see how it goes for you. It is worth trying. All security features work including the iris scanner. Performance wise, you should expect the best out of the box since this ROM runs the Ferrovitus Notorious kernel reported to have the best ratio between performance and battery life. This was pretty much it for the Ambassador ROM. I hope you like my video, if you want to see more about the S8 Ambassador ROM and the live display and edge lining features, check the videos on the screen. I'm Wicked and you can find me on Twitter and Instagram at Let's Get Wicked and on Google Plus at Wicked is here. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for further ROM reviews. As always, thank you for watching, until next time, take care. Wicked is out, bye bye.